how to data merge a business card in Adobe InDesign. Here we have my basic business card designed. I have my logo on the left and here on the right side, I'm gonna have my name, which is slightly bigger than the job title. And below that is the telephone number and the email address. The next thing we need is some data to input into these fields. So I'm inside numbers on a Mac. You can use Excel on a PC and also on a Mac. And just across the top here, we've got the different columns and in these columns, we've got name, title, telephone, and email. These correspond to the design I've already done in InDesign. Below name, I've got the four different names I'd like to data merge. Same for the job title, telephone, and email address. We need to export this file as a CSV file. To do that, I go to File, Export to, and CSV. I'm gonna click Save. I'm just gonna save it inside the folder I've created for this tutorial. Once that's exported, we need to go into the data merge panel within InDesign. You'll find the data merge panel within Window, Utilities, and then Data Merge. Once you have the panel open, we need to go to these four lines at the top right-hand side of the panel. Click on them and select, Select Data Source. We need to select the file we've just saved from either Excel or Numbers. And now you'll see the corresponding name, title, telephone number, and email, which was at the top of each column. So whatever's at the top of each column will be the name of each of these different things. Now we need to add these things that we've got here, these bits of data, to our fields on our design. So I'm going to double click on my name here, click on name, and the title here, I'm gonna click on title. Telephone, just need this bit here, the black bit, and click on telephone email address and click on email. I can click preview and it'll show me how this is going to look. Unclick preview and once you've got everything as you'd like it, we go to this little create merge document and it should pop up a dialog box. We're just gonna go all records, and leave the generate overset text and alert when images are missing. We're just gonna leave it as it is. Click okay. And here we have our designs all data merged in Adobe InDesign. So that's how to data merge a business card in Adobe InDesign. Hope you got something out of that tutorial. If you did, like the video, share it with a friend, consider subscribing to the channel. Thanks for watching this video and please check out another one of my videos on screen now.